a very good day to you. Um, we've had a couple of um, comments regarding certain updates causing problems with the computer. And the thing is, with Windows 10, whenever you, shall we say, uninstall an update, okay, it will try and keep coming back unless you actually prevent it. Okay, now there is actually a tool from Microsoft itself that allows you to prevent it, and we'll show you actually how to do this. For example, okay, what's been happening is people have been complaining about this KB3189866. Okay, so what we will do is we'll just actually close all the windows off for now and just show you how to do it. Okay, so there, go to settings and go to updates and let's assume it installed and caused some problems for you or it might have been a driver installation update that caused a problem anything okay now it might be this one you basically just have to click on this and then sorry you just have to click on uninstall updates and then it will list all the updates that have been installed. Okay, for example, KB3189866. If I want to uninstall this one, I can uninstall it. If I did this, it'll take quite a long time, and then we'll have to restart and all that stuff. So I'll take a smaller one, okay, this Flash Player, and use this as an example. Okay, so we'll just click on uninstall. And then click yes. Okay, so that's the first step. Okay, so you have uninstalled the update. Okay, and now if you do a check for updates, that update would come back on and try automatically downloading and installing. We want to stop that. Now, the tool is okay, and the download link should be we'll post this. It's from Microsoft itself, as you can see, download at Microsoft.com. It's the Microsoft Windows Update Show Hide tool. Okay, and what it'll do is basically you paste that link into your browser, download it, okay, save it, and then you open it. Okay, it's as simple as that. And then now what you need to do is go ahead, click Next, it will do a scan of your computer and also check from Windows Update to see what updates are going to be installed, shall we say, if you were to run Windows Update now. And then it'll give you a chance to kind of like tick the boxes. This can take a couple of minutes because it'll do a full scan. So after it's finished its scan, it gives you this option, okay? Now, if you had used this previously and blocked some updates and you found that you actually want to now install those updates that was previously blocked, you would click on this one. If you want to hide a new update, basically it'll do a check to see which updates are about to come and you can then tick them. For example, we deleted that Adobe Flash Player as you saw a couple of minutes back. Just click on that one and then click Next. And then it'll basically give this little green tick box saying you won't get that. Close this. That's fine. And if you were to go to settings. Now, when we are running our update check, it should come back without showing that update needing to be downloaded and installed. So hopefully this has helped. And please click the like or the subscribe button. Thank you.